What's up, y'all? It's Mel. I'm back with another eating chat. Um, Keith is not with me today. So, and neither did I want to wait on her. So, I went on here, I made my food. I made uh, mussels and clam, and clam sauce with some fettuccine. I'm drinking on that good old age too old. Big girl ain't here and she wouldn't do nothing. But give you a cold drink. Big girl is from the coldest water bottle. <clears throat> now, I'm not going to tell y'all I'm going to be as talkative as Keisha has been over the last couple of videos. But I will get my points in and whatnot, whatnot. Okay? Um... I'm going to say grace. I'm picking these limp balls on my placemat. Um, I'm going to go ahead on and say grace, and I'm going to start the video and whatnot, whatnot. Oh, my God. That was great. Thanks for me. I just see the best of the name. That's the type of name. I messed around and put red chili flakes on there. I don't know if y'all can see it. So I'm hoping it's not too hot. So, how was y'all day? I know I'm kind of low. Uh, I'll try to vocalize in this video. If it happened, it happened. If not, I tried. Somewhat. See, and it's still kind of piping hot. If you can see the smoke coming off it. That stuff sprinkled on top is parsley and, uh, as I see, the red chili flakes and some grated parmesan. So, how was y'all's day? Boy, did I have a day. You know, and it makes no sense. Excuse me. Because I go up there to be with Keisha, but Keisha goes to class, and then I'm left alone by myself for a few hours. So, I'm like, mm. I do a little bit of this, a little bit of that. that because I eat too much Parmesan cheese. It's kind of salty. So I went up there today and um, the man was questioning me. I don't know what for though. about you got books over there oh yeah and Should have made me some toast. 
because I'm not necessarily eating. You know, there's a brought down now. Wow. He should cook chicken wings though. I'm doing this video and getting it out the way or else I won't do a puzzle. And yeah, I got a puzzle table, but this is the best table for me, you know, the best surface for me to do a puzzle on. So that's why I'm, I won't get this video out of the way. You know, and whatnot, whatnot. I got the dog puzzle. Why you didn't close the door back? Excuse me. All right, y'all. My bad. That was Keisha talking about uh, I just dozed off. Sound like somebody old grandma. And she don't want grandkids. Why would you say that to me, Keisha? I don't want grandkids. I just too short not to want them. I do, I want them now. Are you ready now? Mm -hmm. Maybe. Not as well. I just want to push it back as far as I can. I was watching a video today. And it kind of fucked my head up. It was um, a shot from Love is Love. And she was eating oysters on the hair set. But Mel, you like oysters. You'll eat them on the hairstyle. Yeah, I will. Well, why was it fucking your head up? Because they was raw? No. Not that reason. The reason it fucked my head up is Love is Love had just did a video. No, it's not Love is Love. It's Love, Love. She had just did a video and she won't eat rest steak. Not even medium well rep. And that's just crazy to me. It's How you can eat raw oysters but you can't eat raw steak? Well, medium steak. And that kind of messed my head up. Like, eating raw oysters is nastier to me than eating rest steak, you know?
need to hurry up. Well, Popeye told him I asked. I'm going to get that two piece before I get to work. You think? Our son been trying to convince us since yesterday to get Popeye's. Well, he has to pass Popeye's on the way to work. And he's like, do you really think? Hell yeah. He um, messed around and got Louisiana in the kitchen, but no, they ain't no Popeye. No. Then he was complaining about the chicken. That right there should let us know he was fucking lying. He only had ten dollars. Mm-hmm. Cause you can't get nothing out of Louisiana in the kitchen like that with no ten dollars. What? You need five people. He don't want just legs. That boy do not just want legs. Man, he was going to have the magic school bus leave us today. I was like, come on, I ain't trying to wait till no six o'clock, because that's how they do you. You miss your bus? Oh, well, I want to be back around about two, three hours. and I don't know what to do no more. They told me to go to Metro and talk to me. All right. What I want to talk to them about? This is my, my communication because I know that's something they doing on their end because I don't have cellular service. But at the store, man, I can't afford no another phone, and that's what they're gonna try to kick to me. Mm-hmm. Oh, this phone's so old, they don't even make LGs no more. You need to go ahead on and trade up or get to something new. What you got for ten dollars? <laughs> <laughs>
I'm serious. That's where I'm at because I could buy a little cheap phone for all the talking and texting I do. Like, Like, I don't really need okay. Wi-Fi. Flip. For the past two weeks, I only been able to use the phone in my house. And this piece of ice about me. I should have did that to you. My ice bag. Yeah. You had my phone. I know, that's why I said that. I wasn't thinking. Man, I saw the reading, y'all. Finally saw it. I guess it was good. Mm. You ain't see it. And if you guess it's good, you haven't really saw it. So we gonna, we gonna see it. Monique was a fool, though. I, I, I can't say that much. Monique was a fool. That motherfucker, yeah. I really wonder about this woman's mental state. Like, that was like the strays. I'm not worried about that. That was like the strays fucking times a hundred. Damn. Right. Man, if that's true, I got to see this. See, my daughter put one of them apps, you know one of them wishy-washy type apps, on her phone, and we sprayed it to the TV. Now, my biggest complaint about that was, no, clear, man, we know you got a complaint. But if you would have been watching it like I was, you would have had one too. Let me run it to you. We watching the movie. For one, there's this big band at the bottom of the screen. Pick up maybe a, a fifth of the screen. So they got bootleg apps. If you want to watch this without the banner upgrade. Oh no. Then after my daughter upgraded, it still was skipping and whatnot. Like, bitch, this is like a cut up movie to me. I don't know if I'm missing parts or not. <laughs> Then halfway through the movie, it cut off. Oh, I just played too much. I was like, 
Man, I gotta find me somebody with HBO. HBO Max? Yeah. Uh, hello, Mr. Todd. I have that. Yeah. I've been having HBO Max since it came out. I didn't know I was on now. Hmm. This woman, this woman. And she kept me in the dark. I keep you in the dark, I told you. Didn't I? If you would have told me, I'd have been watched it. Not bad. That mug was good. I watched that. I watched that Chris Rock comedy show. It was Chris Rock is a good comedy. I don't care what nobody says. Hey, you know how to zoom relief. Like I'm gonna be on the floor laughing, but you are gonna take some of his jokes, which you know it, it, that's Chris Rock. Then I watched something else. What was it? Oh, <laughs> F is for family. And I started watching Luther on Hulu. But F is for family is on Netflix. That's animation, right? Yes, it's animated. But you thought Stan was bad. You thought Peter was bad. You thought... Homer was bad. This dude here. What, look. My daughter saw it on my uh, continue watching. And she was like, what is that? I said, oh, hold on. This so happened, this episode, him and his wife was beefing. They were beefing about their oldest son. She talking about you let him drown, that's why he's messed up and all this good da, 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 da. Then they started fighting. Well, not fighting, but then they really got into a fuss. Then they sat on the bed talking about, oh, I'm so sorry, I'm so, uh, I don't know why we do this. Then they started, you know, being family. <laughs> you laughing. Their youngest son was under their bed. Right. Now, how could you yeah. lay there and see the clothes start flying? And yeah, I, mean, I know you mortified at that point. Because I know I would have been. Yeah. You know, I know you mortified at I that mean, point. But when you crawl from out under the bed and you see your daddy's hairy balls and furry ass pounding your mama. What makes you decide to go back under the bed? Oh, I don't really know. <laughs> right. I don't really know. They just had to know I was there. So, he goes back under the bed. They start hitting him in the head. From the mattress. Mm -hmm. It's hitting him in the head. And he just like... <laughs> I had to crawl oh, up out of there. Right. I didn't mean, I'm in here. I'm in here. Now that's the second time he's been traumatized. The episode before that, his daddy took him to a, a baseball game. Mm -hmm. And uh, he was like, Dad, I got to use the bathroom. And so the daddy was like, boy, I'm busy. Go ahead on. So his boss's wife offered to take him. She offered to take him because she wanted to eat. While he was in the bathroom, mm -hmm. he go up in the bathroom, he see men pissing, he see men throwing up, he see all kind of shit. And from that moment, he didn't even use the bathroom. His eyes just got big. And he never, it didn't change till he got home. Yeah. And that's why he went to use the bathroom. Yeah. I was like, wow. 
Whoever created that shit, wow, like a motherfucker. I'm gonna have to look that up. But <clears throat> that's what I've been doing lately. Other than going to the library and being harassed. I know I said that earlier, but I never told y'all what I was talking about. Uh, last week there was an incident <coughs> with some books I wanted. Well, when I went back, I returned the books. And, uh, you know what? I'm going to have to fucking talk to them. Because what if they put them books on me? When they, when they went to return them, mm -hmm. you know, they was already on me. Mm -hmm. But what if when they, I went to return and they just checked them out to me? I never checked. Hold on one second. Hey, Curtis. Mm -hmm. Hold on. All right, y'all, I'm back. See, I got 11. One, two, three. Okay, no, they didn't put them on me. Okay. Now, I, uh, I guess I'll show that tomorrow on my, my live. So if you're interested, it's mail, baby. <laughs> I'm going to try to go around 10, 10, 30-ish. Okay, 9.30. But, uh... They, they, that library is... It amazes me. Because they're advanced. And what I mean by advanced is... Do you know... They have movie night. Really? They have movie night every Saturday. And they also have a little table in there if you need to catch the bus. Mm -hmm. If they got them, they put them on the table. I saw one that expired on Saturday and one that expired on Friday. You talking about like the bus coupon? Bus tickets. That's nice. And, um,. I saw something today, I think it's kind of far due, so I don't know if I won't do that while I keep in school, knowing I don't have no phone. But we saw a farmer's market. I saw it. I don't know if Keisha saw it. And it's down the way. I'm like, yeah, Mel. That, that sounds like a good idea. I don't know exactly what kind of plants or whatever they're selling, but, you know, who knows? You know, I started my own rain bucket, and my, and my, my, my woman had it kicked over. I'm a I didn't know that's what that was about. But if you had to put it on the dirt, that would have been gone. Then you just put them on the dirt dirt get rid of them then? Them damn mosquitoes, man. Man. Make a claim. Declare loss. What? Estimate fines. What? You know, that's how I'm going to say mosquitoes. Now I got to go to the library next week. Unless I go online and renew these fucks. And hope, but they don't have no holes on them, so hopefully I can renew them without having to give them back. But a few of these books don't belong to that library. 
Uh, but yes, if you're interested in farming and all that other good shit, come on over to his mail baby. We talk about uh, the urban gardener. And urban gardening does not necessarily mean you have to have a yard. I, uh, this year, I've, uh, I'm starting experimenting with using grow bags and buckets. Because as long as you keep the plant alive, it'll keep producing for you. Now, I don't know if the second season will be better. But I know as long as you keep it alive, it'll keep producing for you. So, I'm finished eating. Hope y'all had a good day. Uh, I'm about to sign on out. Because this here is calling my name. You see all that? And it's 350 pieces. Yes, indeed. So, I start today... Hopefully I can finish it by tomorrow. And uh, now this one, when I finish it, I am going to glue this one. But um, that's a Labrador. That's a Boxer. That's a Chesapeake Bay. Poodle. Alaska Malamute, uh, Australian Shepherd, a collie. I know this dog. That's some kind of cocker spaniel. I'm I'm still looking for a dog. I just ain't found it. Maybe because I don't want people these suckers want for them. And the people that don't want money like that for them are hours away. And I don't want to go hours away to look at no dog that I don't want. <laughs> you know? But, that's all, y'all. I'm saying good night. Y'all be blessed. Y'all stay safe. Tell them whatever it is. We hope y'all enjoyed this video. We love y'all. Y'all take care. Be blessed. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Thank you for coming and watching and rocking with us. And until next time. We're going to plant you down and dig it later because I know y'all can pick up what we are putting down here. Peace. I ain't know what it was all. Peace.